food. Mm -hmm. A big food counter where you can help yourself. Uh -huh. Vegetables. Uh -huh. uh, or well, salads. Yeah, yeah, the cold the cold uh -huh. store. No. Cold plate or something like they call it. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. And there's always a good choice. Yeah. The only problem is potato. They cook the potato, but they don't boil it long enough. It's 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 hard to chew it. Potato shouldn't be like that. When you, you boil it for, you must boil a potato for about, oh, about 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. About 15 minutes, yeah. You sit hard, is it? Or, or sip hard. Sit hard a minute. Yeah? Right. <laughs> yeah. And then it's reasonably soft, but these are not. They're a bit on the hard side, so they need to be boiled. So. I don't get those potatoes anymore. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because it, it doesn't make the salad uh, interesting. It doesn't make it palatable. Like you taste something. Mmm, delicious. That no, <laughs> don't like it. But uh, other things there, all cooked nicely, fresh, n freshly cooked, ready. But not the potatoes. For some reason, they do not cook. The potatoes long enough. You need to be oh, about 20 minutes, really. Yeah. And when they're cold, it's no problem. And like this, it's not as if I'm going to eat them hot. They're they're cold, but they're not cooked long enough. Like a, a carrot, a carrot yeah. has to be cooked a long time yeah. to get maybe. 30 minutes for a carrot, boil that water, cabbage, 5 minutes, quick, but a carrot, oh it takes a long time, so you've got, you've got to slice the carrot very thinly, yeah. see things I've had to learn right in my life, <laughs> right now number 2, who have we got for number 2, a chef, Fourth. Right. Cooks food yeah. you know, in a restaurant. Yeah. And the chef cooks food in the restaurant. A flight attendant. A flight attendant. Right. Serves passengers. For an airline. For an airline. Company. Mm. I'm not sure about the carpenter building a house. Most houses are built of brick, not wood. Carpenters in Japan build houses because all the Japanese houses outside of the big cities are all made of wood. The Japanese love wooden houses. So you, that would be a carpenter's job. But in Bangkok, mm -hmm. buildings are from concrete, concrete and brick and a very hard material. So that would be a builder. That wouldn't be a carpenter. You'd be a builder, a bricklayer. All right. Yeah, so carpenter. A carpenter makes furniture. That's what I think of. a carpenter makes furniture. But we haven't got any wooden. This one? What? Is this wood? Yeah, that would be wood. Carpenter. These are not just wood and metal, but this is not real wood. Yeah. This is fibre. Yeah. Pressed. Mm -hmm. It's like um, fibre chip. Bits of bits of uh, wood all. 
press together, compressed yeah. together, yeah. So there's nothing here that's not really natural. But if you go to, um, I don't remember the name of the place there, up the river, uh -huh. there's a place called, um, uh, just before you get to um, the, the, the stop on the river before Watsoi Tong. What's my town? Big temple. By the, by the bridge uh -huh. over the river. Yeah. The railway bridge. Right there. Near there, there is a place called Wood Street. Oh, yeah. And you can smell the wood. Uh -huh. and there, it's teak. Um, all sorts of wood. And you can smell that wood. Mm. It's like smelling coffee. Like fresh coffee. Yeah. Yeah so different uh, from anything else and wood fresh cut wood mm, smells really really nice yeah pleasant a pleasant smell to it so wood street i think it's called near bang uh, bang po is it bang po just before what saw it on the bus is nyung nyung jet the nyung nyung jet <laughs> Bus number. Don't. No, I don't know. No, well, I used to go up there, you see, where I used to teach before. Mm -hmm. And um, that smell, and I went into the street because I wanted to find out about the, the furniture that they had there. A beautiful hand card. A lot of it was from China and other and other places nearby but doors a wooden door all hand carved and oh, horses on them and things like that and really 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 nice so anything you need wood chairs tables everything you can think of all natural all natural yeah, really really good and not not too expensive not too expensive Ah, expensive. Yeah, but it, it lasts a long time. Yeah. It's not going to break easily. Yeah. yeah. Very good, very good design and construction. Yeah. So it's got good value. Yeah. You, you can always sell it, but these, you can sell these, but not at a very high price. <laughs> these have got a, a very low value. Yeah. Once, once they've been sold new, then they're second hand. But they've got no real value. Alright, so we've got the carpenter. Yeah. Receptionist. A receptionist. Answers the phone. Yeah. Office. In an office. Yeah. Right. And also, it's got in a hospital there. A receptionist in a hospital. Inquiry. Yes. Uh, if you want to find the hospital, you've got to go to the through the switchboard, uh, and they that, that's where the receptionist will be working. Hospital reception. Yeah. Hello, hospital reception. How can I help you? I said, oh, yeah, I can. I want to go to ward. So I do it. Yeah. But at the at the moment, like we are in an office. And the last one, easy nurse. one, the nurse. Yes. The yeah. nurse cares for patients and in our hospital. In our hospital. Right. Yes. Okay. Now that, the nursing, yeah. nursing career, so what would you do if you went to um, England? What, would you, what do you think you would do yeah. Look, for employment? Would you do what you're doing now, or would you try something else? Abroad. My work. Mm. Abroad logistics. Logistics. Yes, it's yeah. a, a, a transportation. Transportation. Yes, mm -hmm. you pay for it. You pay for it. And that would like shipping, export, yeah, import, yeah, uh, freight forwarding. Yeah. Yeah, that's an interesting job. But, but if you... If you thought about changing your career, uh, there's a 
There's good good work in England for uh -huh. give that to the to the um, home and they provide assistance but they need nurses to look after them so you become a care assistant nurse so not, not the same not the same as a, as a nurse in a hospital who specializes in in hospital work as a care assistant you are going to be taught how to um, give your patients, mm -hmm. they're not called patients, they're clients. They're all clients because they're not like hospital people. Right? So, uh, so you look after the clients, you've got to be able to check their, check their pulse, check their blood pressure. Uh -huh. right? They've got machines now. Before, you had to wrap, uh -huh. wrap the uh, a bandage round the arm and then pump it up and then it you read you read off oh dear no, I didn't like doing that I, I, I learned to do it in a hospital yeah I, I, that was that was one of the I thought I'd change my job I'll be a care assistant and I took five days five days of vocational training so you put you you go to a, a company that trains you and then you get your certificate and then off you go. You can go uh, to hospitals, the hospital is short of nurses. The nurses are on holiday. They need someone for two weeks, four, four weeks maybe. And they, they can take, take in the care assistant. You're not allowed to give to give injections, mm -hmm. but that's got to be done by, by the qualified yeah. nurse. But they will train you yeah. to be able to do that because they want you to improve your your assistant's knowledge yeah. and, and uh, improve your qualification. Mm -hmm. So you can go very high. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and there's a lot of work. So, and if you don't, you like to move, Go to different hospitals um, anywhere in London. Yeah, there's many, many hospitals in London. Care homes for elderly people, and we might specialise in in perhaps children, looking after children. Okay, we learn children with learning difficulties or something like that. But that's a specialist. But you can get. Get trained for it as a care assistant. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, well, I couldn't do it. Um, it was interesting. It was useful for me to know it right? because you could look after people, help them, mm -hmm. which I could do. But in the long term, I, no, I couldn't see myself staying at this at this type of um, employment. <laughs> but it was worth a try. It was worth a try, so I got my certificate. Mm -hmm. But I didn't. I didn't want to do it. But it was easy, easy enough to do. Take take people's temperature, and now you do it with a with a digital gauge. So you press a button, put it in the mouth, and it goes beep 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 beep. You read their temperature. You check their blood pressure. Put their hand inside a 
inside like yeah. um, a machine. And it, yeah. All these things now are getting so so helpful and easy for you. So there's no so that could be a a job to think of if you ever thought of changing your uh, changing your occupation. So ah, oh, fancy doing something else, mm. something different, and that. There's always work, always work. I mean, there's no one's ever, no one ever has problems finding work. Mm -hmm. And you can go anywhere, anywhere in England. Big, big cities, yes. And outside big cities, they usually have lots of um, homes for elderly people. And they need someone to go and visit these people. These people can look after themselves up not 100%. Right, so they need you to go around to check on them, to make sure that, and then you, you have to um, write down all the information. But that will probably be done on a computer now. Yeah, so you go and visit these people, see if they're all right. Yeah, they're all right, they're fine. If they have medicine, they have tablets, make sure they've got everything. And uh, it, it's, it helps. It helps the people uh, to stay in their own home. They don't feel um, frightened because they've left their home and they're living in it's somewhere they don't know before. And it's, uh, it can be a bit difficult, but if it's a person who's staying in their own house and they've got their dog, they have a cat, and all those sort of things, and it's a very rewarding, worthwhile uh, experience if you fancy doing something like that, looking after elderly people in their own homes. Mm. But you can still work in the hospitals when they need extra staff or um, for a company. Your company will send you to regular places and you might say, no, I don't want to do that. I'll be a freelance. I'll be a freelance, yes. <laughs> so you can go all around England. You don't have to stay in one place. And then you get experience. And then you think, all right, now, right, enough. I'll get one place, stay there, and, and settle and settle down. But it, you will gain a lot of experience. And they, they really look out for people who are interested in that sort of career and it is a career for the rest of your life for the rest of your life so you're well looked after all right yeah you get pension things like that when you your money a certain amount it will go into a pension fund because the company has to if you're ill you can't work they'll have to send you some money you, when, ready for when you're strong enough to go back to work. So it's like an insurance scheme, basically. Yeah, it's well worth it. But my two daughters, no, they wouldn't do it. I said to them, get a job as care assistant. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, because it's talking to other people and being helpful and friendly, which they can do, but it's uh, you've got to want to do it. It's a job that you've got to want to do. So, yeah. but, like being an airline. An airline, yeah. right? The, uh, flight the flight attendant. Yeah. Yeah. You've got to want to do that. It's so different. And you're up there, right? No parachute. Oh. Ooh. It's, that's an interesting job, right? Yeah. For, but only for a limited time. You, you have to think about, am I going to be well, too old yeah. to work? Yeah. You'll have to find another job. Perhaps within the airline company, but not doing the same thing anymore. Yeah. So it's a short term, so like 10 years. It's going to be 10 year job, airline attendant because uh, they, you'll, get, you'll get jet lag and things like that. You, you're flying one place, 
get off the plane, another country, yeah. and you're tired, and uh, people say, come on, come on out, let's have a talk. Yeah. You can't do that anymore. You've got to get a nice night's sleep, because you've, yeah. got, you've got 300 people to look after, 10 miles up in the air. Yeah, yeah so you've got to be the, the hostess. Yeah, everything. Yeah. Just, uh, Psychiatrist, just yeah, no. that is a job that you need to think about very hard. Yeah. About is it going to be is it going to be suitable mm -hmm. for you? Yeah. And work on a cruise liner. If you go on the on the ship, oh, yeah. oh, you have hundreds of people to look <laughs> after, and depending what job you're doing. Hundreds of people, so you can do any job on that ship, but you don't have to do one where it's people to people. Yeah. You can be in an office, in yeah, the office on, office on the ship, yeah. Yeah, yeah. you can be arranging bookings, yeah. yeah, things like that, or even answering the telephone, yeah. the telephonist. Yeah. So there's many, many jobs. Mm -hmm. right. So, in, ca in case you're going to get, hmm. I think I'd like to change my job. I'll just give you a few ideas. Right, don't go to McDonald's. Right? Don't go to McDonald's, right? KFC, 7 uh, Eleven. <laughs> right, now, conversation. Where do you work? Right, two people, Jason and Andrea. Right. And uh, Jason, right, I'll be, I'll be Jason. You can be Andrea. Yeah. Right. So I'm going to ask you, where do you work, Andrea? I work at Tom Thomas Group Tower. Oh, really? What do you do there? I'm a guy. I take people on tour to country in South America, right? Peru. 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 Yeah. Peru. Peru. <laughs> think, of a, think of a cat. A cat purr. Purr. A cat purrs, right? Purr. Purr. Peru. <laughs> yeah. Like Peru. Hmm. How interesting. Yes, it's guest star. I love it. And what do you do? I'm a student and I have a part time job too. Oh. Now, when it says two, I don't like this word. Yeah. Also. Yeah. As well. As well. As well or also. Because when they put two, that sounds like two jobs. Oh. <laughs> yeah. But some people can get, if like they learn in English and things like that, so they think two. Two things. Two T W O. No, oh. it's not. It's T O O. Yeah. This is not a very good word to use. So I have a part-time job as well. Uh, oh, where you where you work? In a fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Yeah. Okay. Right. So you can be Jason, mm -hmm. right? and I'll be Andrew. Okay, how are we going now? Where you work and there? I work at Thomas Cook Travel. Oh, really? What are you there? I'm a guide. I take people on tours to countries in South America, like Peru. How oh, interesting. Yes, it's a great job. I love it. And what do you do? I'm the Asturian. And I have a part-time job as well. Oh, where do you work? In the fast food restaurant. Which restaurant? Hamburger Heaven. Hmm, sounds great. Hamburger Heaven. Hamburger. Like a Mac. A high Mac. Mm -hmm. On top of a mountain. Hamburger Heaven. Mm -hmm. Oh no, it's not on top of a mountain. Mate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. But hamburger, working in a restaurant. It's not a restaurant as so such, it's a fast food. Now they've got new names for these places. I don't call them cafes and 
restaurants anymore, they're called outlets. Outlet. Outlet. Now, 7-Eleven is a, is a 24 hour outlet store. It's an outlet store. Uh, Foodland is a, yeah, it's an outlet. An outlet. Some new words came in about, oh, I think it's about three years ago they started using it. Uh, 108. Do you remember 108 store? Uh, family, oh, family yes, store. Yes, there was a family store. 108 shop. Oh, yeah. These are outlets. They're called yeah. outlets. Not, not 24 hour stores. Down, down, yeah, yeah. 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 A lot of those are finished. Now I have many seven eleven. Every, everywhere seven eleven. Good for me. Uh, I, now I'm, I'm a 7-Eleven <laughs> fanatic. Yeah. I'm a fan. I like 7-Eleven. There's a good variety of food, and it's it's healthy food. Some of it is very healthy, like juice, yogurt, yogurts, and things like that. I eat lots of yogurt. Mm, many, many yogurts. I love them. But um, CP uh, meals that you put in the microwave, yeah. microwave meals. I use, uh, I get the uh, Korean chicken, chicken and rice. Mm -hmm. Rice with vegetable mm -hmm. and then Korean chicken. Chicken, it's Korean style, not real yeah. from Korea, but I use the the sauce, special yeah. sauce, and it's yeah. delicious. It's not, see, if it's Thai, it's oh, too hot. Mm. I cannot eat hot food. Yeah, no, I don't like it. If I, want, if I want hot food, I get uh, chili, chili um, powder, chili powder. Uh -huh. Not, not the chili. Get the chili, it's uh, too hot. Oh, no. I love it. <laughs> I like peppers, yes. right, but the, the big pepper, sweet pepper, mm -hmm. yeah, the red, the green, oh, the yellow. I don't like it. No? No. Oh, no, 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 they're delicious. Oh. You get a little pepper, yes. green, orange, Here white, yeah, they're, they're hot. Hot. Yes, yes. It can be right in, in a soup, tom yam kung. Yeah. I put peppers in it, and but sometimes I put too many, too many um, herbs in there. Too many herbs. They flavour it too much. Why? Well, I just I can buy a packet of soup, uh -huh. right? normal soup. I can ask yeah, you guys. and it's. Uh, Tom Yam Kong. Uh -huh. Yeah, and it's alright, I like it. No problem. But it's easy to make. There's no. no and then. Not original. But when you're playing, when you're playing with peppers, uh -huh. right, and you go. Uh -huh. oh, you spend the next hour wiping your eye because you've got some hot pepper in the oh, yeah. You must wash. Yeah, yeah. And chili pepper, chili pepper, chili powder, paprika, paprika powder, that's nice. Yeah. KN, KN powder. Right, we'll have a little break. Alright, five minutes. I need to get a cup of tea. Get my, uh, my throat's beginning to croak a bit. Wow.
อยู่ไหนเด็กเลยเด็กยังเด็กเนี่ยเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด็กเด
she loves it, and that's like Roy Persen. Yes. Yeah, she loves yes. it. Your job. Your job. Do you like it? How's it? Yeah, how's it? How's And what, what would you like to do? I know. If you could change, you could change, have another, have another career, do another job. What would you like to do? change can you change your work now or do you have to stay maybe uh, but and now I stay uh, money yeah. for yeah. for yeah. both of my guys if you worked on a cruise liner if you worked on that big ship yeah, yeah it would go take you to America <laughs> no <laughs> do you want yes. to make a get paid you get paid for it. <laughs> right, now complete these conversations and then practice with a partner. So what? What do you do? What do you do? That means what work do you do? Someone says to you, what do you do? What do you do? Oh, I'm a student, I'm a doctor, I'm a teacher, I'm a lawyer. I'm a train driver, I'm a <laughs> taxi driver. <laughs> we don't get ordinary jobs like that when people say ask these questions. What what job do you do? So, oh I'm an engineer. You see with the engineering there are lots of different types of engineering. Mechanical engineering, electrical engineering construction mm -hmm. engineering so many many different choices everybody think engineering is just one one uh, type of work but it isn't it's a big variety of engineering yeah. what do you do i'm a full-time student i study the violin yeah. and where do you where do you go to school? And where do you go? Where do you go to school? Oh. Hello. So some people say, and what, what school do you go to? What school do you go to? What yeah. do you go to? And where do you go to school? What school do you go to? Many people ask that question. Instead of saying, and where do you go to school? What school do you go to? Sounds a lot easier to me. What school do you go to? What course? Yeah, what school? sounds a lot better than what go to, what school do you go to? You attend something, it means <clears throat> you're going there for a, a reason, for a purpose, to, to, really, to really do something, to improve your knowledge, to enhance your, your work capability, your, enhance your knowledge. So it improves your knowledge. For the future, okay, makes it better for you. But you say, what school do you go to? You go to school, it just sounds like you just go to school and that's it. Just go and do nothing. Just go. 
And now, when you attend, it's got a meaning, more meaningful. Everybody goes to school. Do they learn anything? Some people learn something at school. If you attend school, it sounds, it sounds like you want to be there. You want to learn something. <clears throat> right, so and what's school? And do and what do you? And where do you go to school? I go, I go to the New York School of Music. Wow! <laughs> so, how do you like your classes? Yeah. Well, you could just say, wow. Do you like your classes? Do you like your classes? Another one, you don't need to put how. No, you don't need to put it in. Or you could say, wow. And do you like your classes? Yeah, and do you like your classes? I like them very much. I like them a lot. A lot. Yeah, I like them a lot. I like them very much. Yes. Okay, is there anything we need to go over there? I'm a full time student studying. I am a full time student. Studying, studying Nothing. the violin. Yeah, you could, that sentence, they've got two sentences, you can make it in one sentence. I'm a full time student studying the violin. Hmm, right, so you've said everything in one sentence, not in two sentences. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm a full time student studying the violin, studying, studying, studying the violin. Yeah. two sentences, you only need one. Mm -hmm. I'm a full-time student studying the violin. Well, I'm a full-time student, comma, studying the violin. Uh, comma, studying the violin. Well, instead, of, instead of saying two sentences, you're just using one sentence. Yeah, it makes, it makes it easier. I like to see a sentence, ten words in a sentence, right? And a sentence can have what, two, three, fifteen, twenty words in it. But providing you put a comma in there, right, so you pause, it's like a pause, and then instead of going straight through, um, I'm a full-time student, I I'm a full-time student studying the violin. I'm a full-time student, comma, studying the violin. But the other ones, yeah, that's all right, but I'd use one, one sentence, not two. Yeah. yeah. That's, what, that's how I think. <laughs> right, but if it, I pass that information on to you, you might say, hmm, right, that sounds like a good idea. Then you can you can adjust adjust your own answers to suit that. Mm -hmm. Right, and number two. Well, right. What do do? What does Tanya do? What does Tanya do? What does Tanya do? Hmm, well, she's a teacher. She teaches an art class at a school in Denver. Where's Denver? Where's Denver? You don't know. Denver is in Colorado. Colorado is next door to Texas, I think. And Colorado is where the, <coughs> the Rocky Mountains come down from Canada down into America. It's, it's one of the few areas where they've got lots of snow. They go skiing in Colorado. But Colorado has got a desert. It's so hot. And yet they've got the Rocky Mountains with snow on them, but in a desert area, it's really, it's 
it's really unusual. Yeah. We get we have to get a bigger map of the world. <laughs> this is too small. This is too it's really so small. Right. All this there's and the states, I don't think they're marked. Yeah, I think I think Colorado's somewhere like that. Colorado is famous for a for um a disease in a plant, a plant and a potato, a Colorado beetle. Colorado beetle lays its eggs in the potato and kills all the potatoes. Big problem in the nineteen in the nineteen fifty. Yeah. Colorado beetle. It came to England from America. And from Colorado. <laughs> yeah, that is a black and white, a black and white insect that would uh, destroy all the all the um, potatoes in the ground, so you couldn't eat them. Yeah, Colorado. Fame. See, I think of that, but people remember Colorado for skiing. They had the Olympic Games there a long, long time ago. American Winter Games. Um, Colorado, yes. Oh, and Denver. Yeah, Denver's got another something famous for. Right, so she attends. What does Sam do? She's a teacher. She teaches an art class at a school in Denver. And what about Ryan? Where does he work? 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 He works. He works for a big company. For a big computer company in yeah, San Fran. Some people just end up saying Frisco. In Frisco. Yeah, they don't say San Francisco, they cut it down a bit. Like Los Angeles is LA, oh, yeah. New York, and Yeah. <laughs> mm. BKK. BKK, yeah. I just say so BK. <laughs> yeah. That's the postcode. Postcode is BK. The postcode, BK. One zero one two zero here oh, postcode, yeah. but BKK is the um, airline uh, tag on your on your luggage label. It would be London Heathrow to Bangkok. It would be LDM uh, London something. I can't remember. <laughs> but uh, the other one is uh, BKK Bangkok. I never keep my labels. No, I used to keep. I used to keep the labels like a souvenir. Mm. Now, hey, what does he do? What does he do? What does he do? What does he do? What does he do exactly? What does he do exactly? Yes. Website. He's a website so designer. He designs. designs well, but you could put another word in there. You design something. What, what other word is this? similar or the same as design? What other word? You design something. Yeah. Create. You create. Yeah. yeah. Create. Right, so design. You design something. But you can also say you create, you oh, create yeah. something. Yeah, similar word. So I think I think you can use that yeah. as well. So a designer and a creator. Yeah. Yeah. Designing, creating. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So which, which one would you think? <laughs> Design. See, so, so, look, he's a website designer. We we sometimes don't like to use the same word twice. So he's a website designer. He creates fantastic websites. We 
if you're saying he's a website designer, he designs. Fan we know he. We know he designs. Yeah, it's, it's using two words, the same designer, design. Yeah, the designer creates. The designer creates something. So I, I look for another word to use instead of the same. It's not quite the same, right? Design, designer, right? But something that means the same. Design, creator. Construct, compose. I like compose. Not not quite the same, it's not quite a but it's in a similar but create designer, creator, composer, right? This is usually for music. Composer. You compose something, yeah. For for um, for music. Yes. Uh, but a creator can be the same as a designer. Uh -huh. Yes. Creation and design, creating and designing, very, very closely related to each other. And a website, a spider creates a web. Mm -hmm. A spider creates it, makes the web. So. Maker. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 So that another word, but aspire, creates, designs. Does it? Yes. Would you call a spider a designer, or is that spider only yes. making the web, creating? It's creating it. It's starting from nothing. It's a creation, but it's 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 a design. A spider's web is a design. So the spider is the spider a designer. Is he a designer of the yes. webs? It's all got to be done. It's all got to be done a certain way. A web. I can't do it. I'm not a spider. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to get a spider in to show us. <laughs> Intricate, intricate work done by the spider to create this beautiful web. Ah, uh, mm. yeah, yeah. It's, it's almost perfect when you look at a spider's web that's created, it's been designed, designer and creator. Yeah. Mm, two, two, two skills, two, two skills. Design something and create something. But does it know what it's doing? Why does it do it? How does it do it? What's going on in its mind? No one's been able to find out. I have to make a film about it. Spider-Man 4. Music, studying the violin. Mm -hmm. The violin. Do you do you study music? Yeah. yeah? I study. What uh, do you think? Lady Gaga. Oh. <laughs> Britney Spears. Yeah. Um, I listen. Tomorrow we're there. This is this Is it? Yeah. No, no, no. no. Two December. Um, yeah, second of December. Two December. Mm. Second December. I, I, I listened to Katie, Katie Perry, yeah. Kelly Clarkson, uh, Kelly Cobay, oh, lots of singers. I can't, can't get you know them out. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I listen. About these, what do you know about these jobs? So, a flight attendant, a doctor, a doctor, right? Oh, works, a doctor works in a hospital or a surgery. Surgery. 
like an office, small, small, what they call a GP, a general practice, is one doctor and about a hundred patients, something like in, in a small village or something like that, you get one doctor. So a doctor can work in, works in a, a surgery, his office is called a lot of surgery. The doctor's surgery. The surgery. Doctors work. The doctors work base. Or a doctor can work in in the hospital. Right, so the surgery is a small a small 